Well, rising stars from all over the region were honored at the annual National Joint Powers Alliance Banquet. Along with their academic accomplishments, the honorees were recognized for their personal triumphs as well. Logan Gay has more. For 25 years, the National Joint Powers Alliance has been recognizing students for their academic achievements. It's work that we know is important. Uh, it recognizes students, uh, recognizes the work of our uh, education entities, and is really a celebration uh, for our entire region. Without this ceremony, many of those students would not receive any recognition for their hard work or unique achievements. Oftentimes, the students that are forwarded by uh, the, the, either the superintendent, the principal, or the teachers are quiet leaders who uh, may not otherwise be recognized because maybe they're not the valedictorian, they might not be the star athlete, they might not be the person who's leading student senate, but they lead in other ways. They've overcome adversities, um, they've had uh, uh, great experience or their role models that otherwise don't necessarily get called out in some of the typical celebrations we would know happen in school. Many of the honorees face various obstacles but through their own determination are still going to graduate from high school. Jeremiah Dufler is one of those students. He was a victim of bullying and suffered from bipolar depression, but yet he still managed to get straight A's every semester since the seventh grade. And he plans to attend the University of Minnesota Morris. Despite all that teasing and the struggles, I decided that I just got to keep pushing forward. And I had my goal of graduating with at least 4.0, and I, I'm going to do it. They are hoping that their stories will inspire other students to live up to their full potential. Just always work hard and have a smile. Keep your head up, keep working hard. Uh, there's always people that will help you through things, so just keep working hard and dedicate yourself. And Brainerd, Logan Gay, Lakeland News. All the students receive $250 scholarships and door prizes. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.